let me just take a moment and tell you what uh, the focus of my channel is gonna be in the following like period so um, you might think that I've been all over the place with uh, these uh, videos that I've been posted but that I've been posting but that's not actually the case uh, if you look closely you might uh, actually see that I've been very focused on like two or three topics and that's what I'm gonna focus on in the next uh, period of time I'm I'm not gonna define it specifically because I don't know it might change so uh, two of the topics that I'm gonna talk about are quite very closely connected to each other while uh, one of them is uh, not connected to the other two so uh, the two topics that I've been doing many videos on are like computer programming and more specifically machine learning so I've been doing a lot of videos on machine learning and deep learning lately and um, uh, the other like related topic so these two are related uh, deep learning videos and cybersecurity videos. So these are the two topics that I'm gonna, uh, uh, I would say, focus on a lot because these are part of my uh, actual active, uh, like, uh, technical interests, I would say. So deep learning videos, uh, I've done a couple of series on machine learning um, and two or three series uh, or just... I guess only one of them is uh, like more uh, geared towards deep learning and artificial intelligence. So I'm going to keep on doing that because there's way too much stuff that that you can talk about and we need more people to be involved uh, in the field of deep learning because there's so much to do. Anyway, so the other topic is cybersecurity, and that's really, that's also really, really extremely important uh, because as we have so many devices connected to the internet nowadays, uh, it sucks to say that, uh, but most of them have, have some sort of like security flaws, and sooner or later, these flaws are. Uh, found out they are revealed uh, people don't update their devices some of them get their uh, like information or credentials leaked uh, and that's it's like uh, there's this uh, there's this saying of the internet of things like all the devices connected to the internet but uh, the real picture is like it's more likely the internet of vulnerable things so sooner or later your device is going to become vulnerable or it already is you just don't know it which is why you always have to try to stay updated with all uh, try to actually update all your devices to their latest the software versions that's kind of like it keeps you safer but not completely safe but because there is no uh, such thing as like absolute or complete or 100% security that's like uh, an illusion okay so deep learning machine learning um, which are one because deep learning is part of machine learning um, I might also do some uh, but I'll discuss maybe I'll discuss this in a different video uh, I might also do different computer programming uh, uh, lessons so deep learning machine learning cybersecurity uh, and I might also get more in depth uh, in terms of cybersecurity because so far I've only been doing like uh, demonstrations of how to uh, like completely own uh, for vulnerable machines from uh, Vulnhub, which is a safe and legal uh, platform to grow your cybersecurity skills. Skills, uh, Vulnhub and Hack the Box, and I, I might also do some demonstration videos or some tutorials on different aspects of uh, cybersecurity. So once again, I'm going to repeat: machine learning, deep learning, cybersecurity, and uh, the unrelated uh, topic to these uh, two is like fitness and nutrition so 
uh, this also has been like a really important part of my life over the past couple of years uh, and I've been doing uh, some videos on uh, mostly nutrition but uh, I have to say that I'm gonna keep doing videos on nutrition and fitness some of them on ketosis, uh, the ketogenic diet, intermittent fasting um, and I'm thinking of also doing like uh, reviews of scientific papers because there are so many good papers that actually are left behind or are uh, are never they don't ever go to the surface because you have like at least two or three million scientific papers written every year and out of those only a few of them shine and many uh, many of the rest are really really good papers but never get actually a chance to uh, get to the surface and I might actually do some uh, some review of scientific papers uh, as well I would say short reviews uh, one of the recent papers that I read was uh, was on L-theanine and it was a which is a supplement which is a an amino acid um, that uh, might help with uh, mood and cognitive improvement and uh, I guess it was a double-blind crossover placebo trial uh, and it actually followed like I don't know a dozen or some number of subjects uh, in terms of how efficient it is in uh, it, with respect to stress reduction uh, but anyway, I digress. So I might also keep doing, I will keep, uh, I will be doing videos on uh, nutrition, not too many on like uh, the um, the fitness part of it, like on um, say, I haven't actually been doing any videos on training and all that stuff, even though I, I weight lift and I do all different types of uh, exercises. Or, or different types of exercising um, I don't know if I'm gonna be talking about this but like I said I digress deep learning machine learning cybersecurity nutrition and fitness and one of the uh, videos that uh, is going to be posted or by the time you're watching this video it might be posted is uh, a recent experiment that I had on um, ketosis and alcohol how drinking uh, whiskey affected my blood ketone levels so you might be on the lookout for that okay so I guess this is a uh, quick update not that uh, so it's already eight minutes in but anyway a quick update on what the channel is gonna be in the following period undefined following period uh, that's it uh, if you have suggestions uh, or things that you might want to talk about, you might want me to talk about in uh, these videos, please leave me a comment in either of the comment sections below. So uh, I guess that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and hope to see you in the next ones.